it's incredible like uh, essentially just a week ago she was as tall as this thing and now she's like double the sides or more <laughs> Rufi doesn't feel like playing right now. <laughs> I need to put another box up here once again with something to try to very entertain. It's cool to see her around while we play. <laughs> Okay, <clears throat> so we are in Belurat Gaol. It is very bad that like this thing doesn't correspond to our real position, but fine. Okay. Okay, so. Oh my god, this place is bigger than I thought. I don't know why I instantly jumped. <laughs> Ultra Instinct still works. Okay, this is strange. I got extremely lucky. It's like finding almost two shiny Pokemon in a row. No, maybe as lucky as finding a single shiny Pokemon. Getting thing to people with that give five times the runes. Yeah, but I think I just got extremely lucky because these guys are normal. I would really like to understand why there are so many ghosts around here. <clears throat> you know what's the problem with these items that give you extra item discovery? The problem is that they should work for like, I don't know, at least 10 minutes, if not more. Like, the worst one should last for 10 minutes. And the fact that you don't see clearly for how long they will last makes you feel like it's worthless to use them. It should last for 10 minutes, 30 minutes, a full, a full hour. At that point, it would make sense to use them. But if a player doesn't know, you'll always feel like they're useless items. This is very cool, and the reason is that, like, if this guy's attacking you, 
from kind of blind spots but they are not so strong they are not so dangerous so it is fine it's not like they randomly get you and one shot you Why are they crying on these spots? I really hope there are no there aren't any secret doors here. Illusionary walls and things like that. I don't know, these places are so strange. There's a huge spot down there. Okay. That's what I was starting to think, remembering all these things are made. Essentially, these jars are filled with living things, and then they can take life. So these ghosts are ghosts uh, coming out of the jars after they are dead. And crying, watching at the jar, thinking all about how they died. Others went to sit there, because maybe that's where they lived previously. Hoping to be able to keep doing what they were doing before really dying. Cool, so we can go down there from here. Whoa. That's it. Huh? Oh my god, this place is fucking terrible. Like, the good news is that... Uh, it's not very dangerous because of the enemies. But if you fall down by mistake, you're... You're fucked. You need to go all the way back here. Oh my god. Okay, I think there are two ways. We can take. This looked like the, the, the most dangerous one.
Oh my god, this was close. Oh no. No, we missed that place. Fuck. Uh, we'll have to explore this place once again. <coughs> Terrible. I wanted to stop the thing as fast as possible. Damn it, this is so annoying. Maybe there is a way, please. Come on, this is so fucking unfair. Why? I got distracted for a second after a jump. And I missed the thing. So these are like uh, things that didn't manage to, they really managed to combine with the jar. Like they are kind of failed jars. <clears throat> well, the truth is only that uh, at the end of the day inside the jar there are these disgusting things. And if they are not uh, fat enough, they can exit. So annoying. <clears throat> ah, fuck all of this. Maybe I could die to come back faster. Ah, for now let's keep going. Just important that I try to remember that I have uh, items to grab. You know what, let's play uh, something. <clears throat> Let's not die yet because maybe maybe we'll actually find a danger that uh, will really manage to kill us before. Without us having to die on purpose. Like, okay, I almost died already. But at least I learned that uh, these things have a very dangerous attack. And I didn't know that previously. Oh my god, come on. It feels like playing uh, that game that was called Cut Mario. Random cringe rage game. Oh. <laughs> <clears throat> 
Oh my god, I managed to turn off the microphone in time. Okay, we went to the right. Okay, so it's from where that guy appeared. It is where I just got the item. This is again from where the guy appeared. So to the right we just come back. We can only go this way. Okay. I did this. Oh, there's an item there. Okay, I think no. I read from here. Yes, I can arrive from here, but what the oh no. <clears throat> Entered from here instead. Oh my god, where the fuck I am? Okay, this is strange. Like, I really lost myself. Oh my god, um, I'm feeling very confused, I thought I was close to the X, oh yes, this is from where I entered, or not, oh, no, the fuck, I 
I'm trying to avoid the uh, keep losing HP because slowly they're going lower and lower. I don't under I really don't understand. I was here. Oh, we are back here. What the fuck is happening? I fucking walk it to the right. I should have. Like, I, w I thought I was here. The fuck? I thought I was here. I like, not to the right. I mean to the left. Makes sense. <coughs> <clears throat> oh my god, what was the stupid cringe jump? I keep feeling very confused, like, that's the fucking engines. Yeah, it is. It's the engines. But there are some of these displays. That's another part. Oh my god, this is very hard to explore. <clears throat> mm. Oh, whoa, this is where I got the item. That was... Inside this part here. My God. Hmm. Okay. Okay, so this part is closed. Again, this is the one of the two entrances. Yes, so entrance. And then I can get here. And this connects you back to the... Okay, so this is like the area one. Yes, I reached the end of this part. Okay, this was... But no, wait. Then I found... Uh, where the fuck he was? No, I went, I went even beyond. Where the fuck I was? <clears throat> okay, so area two. Here, the enemy was here. Okay, so I jumped... I jumped here by mistake. Okay, this is the... Let's call this area 2. 2. Hmm. Again, this single pot to come back to area 1. This from where we arrived. 
And we can continue in this direction. Okay, now we climb it a few more pots. And we are close to the start. To the, um, I don't know, area zero. The initial one, the starting one. where I was when I fall down okay well I suppose I got all the items at least that's what I like to think so again let's call this area 1 but that one was area 0 where we appeared and from here we reach the area 2 going this way we end the expression of area 2 coming back into area 1 I wanted to check a bit more if there was a way to I don't know reach some other ports things like that but does it look like No, just some uh, candles and that's it. We can go. Hello, Ali Brown. It's really terrible that they made such a huge area without an extra grace, nothing. It's unbelievable. And I don't like it to, so much, to be fair, because instead of giving you tough enemies, they decided... They decided to go for tough exploration. Oh my god. I recommend you to play Elder Ring. It obviously depends uh, on what kind of player you are. Did you play any video games for first? <clears throat> uh, how much time do you have to play? And how much time do you think you could spend in this game? Because this is the question you need to answer if you want to understand if Elder Ring is a game for you. So it is impossible. Because this, are, this really is an RPG, open world. This means if you don't explore, if you don't invest some time, you don't get stronger. And if you don't get stronger, fighting enemies and continuing the game becomes harder and harder. So keeping in mind these two things, if you don't have time, uh, it's not a game. 
one can really play, in my opinion. Because it's way, way too hard. Well, if you are willing, if you don't have other games to play, if you're willing to spend, uh, I don't know, I would say at least uh, five hours a week uh, during the weekend only playing this game, uh, I think you can. Otherwise, you will just waste your money. Uh, unfortunately, since now your DLC got released, uh, I think it's full price. If you never played Souls games, uh, like, you need a lot of time to learn how to play the game. I don't have a single way to come back up there. This is terrible. I will lose uh, 97k runes here. This is pretty terrible. We have a buff. What buff do we have? I don't know. Oh, well, maybe it's this thing. Hmm. Oh my god. I'm not interested in any kind of uh, art design job. Work. Sorry. Oh my god. Fuck. Oh my god. <laughs> You're about to ask me if I want uh, to make my channel pretty. I'm not interested. Okay, the good news is that we should be able to grab uh, our runes easily, I suppose. Oh my god. Die Gollum. Okay. I'm, I'm very confused. So went all the way down here to just fight Gollum. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, let's go. <coughs> Ons, a master swordsman who devoted himself to the star line and sword. That's the only ruin away at the end of the procession of stars and busy himself in order to forestall it. Aurioche, an apprentice, was so the technique stubbornly refused to heed his master's words and spent the entire his life at his side in defiance of his self imposed seclusion. This guy is Yosh. Okay. Okay. That's it. 
But at least I know it's just an extra path to explore, I suppose. Bit disappointed. But fine. Okay. So we need to grab the other items we didn't grab the first time. <laughs> well, I guess spirits are part of the game. Okay. Oh my god. Okay, that's where I was previously. And here we are. <sighs> okay, this time... Uh, let's jump on the other part. Uh, here there was nothing. Okay, this is where we had to jump. Oh my god. No, no, no! Fuck! Please kill me. Wait, 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 wait. No, no, no. Oh my god. Because if I die now... It's pretty annoying. If I die now, then I will have to come back all the way here. There's nothing there, so we have to jump here. I don't know, there is a pot there. Hmm. Fucking stupid place. I'm alive. Whoa. I'm a fucking genius. No, what the f- <laughs> We discovered this secret. <laughs> First try like this. Maybe it's 0.01% of the players. Ah, uh, okay. And now. We risk to lose 200k runes to a glitch.
E cioè tu stai alti. Ok. I should keep in mind if, that if I do a mistake here, I die. Ok. Ok, let's go. Well played, Jake! Well played! Let's be careful against explosive pots. Ok, well it's a reward. Does it really matter, but what does really matter is that we managed to find an extra item. Okay, now they need to jump down there, possibly without dying. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay, so for first, let's grab our runes. Then let's come here past. Bye bye! Huh? So let's see. What is that? Oh my god. What the heck are, are we doing? We pressed a strange button. I'm here! <laughs> Amazing! So you can really reach this place! But there are guys down there. Oh my god, there are still secrets. What the fuck? Or. Oh no! I. Oh, I just went there previously, I think, and killed that guy. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, no, no, no. So?
<sighs> oh, it was an item. It is an elm. <laughs> I get you with fits comfortably over the head uh, <clears throat> when upturned. <clears throat> a tired of the shamans who perform their worship at, oh, at Gauls. Use the, the power of throne pots of all sizes. They offer their prayers to the innards of the great jars, such that they might be reborn one day into sainthood. This is the cycle of death and rebirth, taken in the hands of mortal men. Oh. Where's my soldier elm? Okay. Hmm. I think it looks kind of cool. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, whoa, it's huge. <laughs> it's a nice shot for a video. To get here, you need to use the trick. Okay. Now we can jump down here. But I understand that button I pressed. Wait, I can teleport because I'm here? Or now I can teleport, period? I think previously I couldn't teleport. Uh, that was the rune that was stopping your ability to teleport. Uh, incredible. Well, I don't know if there are other secrets, but this is pretty cool. <clears throat> I don't remember if this was a thing in the normal game too. It's definitely pretty impressive. I would appreciate them not uh, telling me that this was happening, to be fair. But fine. <coughs> Okay, well, so, we don't have options anymore, essentially. We can only go to the right on the bridge or to the left. Let's start from this way, since it looks uh, way more natural.
Okay, for first, let's use these runes. As we said, we are not uh, using this thing yet. We'll try to get a few more. Uh, then we'll manage to notice uh, a bit better the difference. Plus, instead of losing my runes to a boss, uh, let's buy a few things. Um, I don't know. Pair of things. Okay. And here we go. Still have the flask that gives me extra damage. I should we switch to the one that gives me extra points because I think getting extra strength does make me stronger right now since I reached the 60. I saw on a trailer. Oh, this is not even a boss. Uh, oh. I saw on a trailer uh, a cat boss. I thought uh, I would find that boss here. Because this looked like a big goal uh, where to fight some bosses. I was wrong. No boss yet. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. Uh. Oh my god. Okay, we need some much of war that makes me do a good AoE here. Still, some of the shitty things around. <clears throat> hmm. Okay, I don't know. Does it look like there are uh, secrets? I try to roll into the walls. Rolling into the walls is enough to open them. Okay, got rid of all of them now. I took the power up uh, last by mistake. A 
Belrad Tower Settlement. We see pictures of the lion. So yes, maybe the boss is actually here, I was right. Or not. <coughs> no, okay. So no, the boss is not uh, at the start of the city, it's at the end. What the? Okay, this thing doesn't... I, I went here and back to see if I could uh, get any statuses, but... Doesn't look like the case. I saw some of, some of my cats moving around here. Oh my god, this place is huge. <laughs> Why? Why making me come? here and not giving anything in exchange went from good design to garbage design unless there is an NPC that will hide around here, I don't know we can summon torrent Oh, okay. Oh, wait a moment. No, no, I, I'm... I feel really confused. For a moment I was thinking, wait, maybe there are shadows. But then there are also... Things that looks more physical. So yes, maybe these guys are shadows. But the fact that they are shadows doesn't mean they are living things. They're still like maybe some kind of uh, spirit. The same thing as if you're dead. Okay, this must be a shortcut. Exactly. Nice. This looks like uh, the first castle on Dark Souls 3. <clears throat> okay, so we can go down here or there. Let's start by going there.
Bro, hello. I saw some runes arriving. I thought one of them maybe jumped down and died. We have to go inside the, the well. I can just run straight and ignore the enemies. But if I want to explore around here, it's better to kill all of them. So, since we are killing all of them... Let's explore these parts first. Full shadows. Okay. <clears throat> well. Oh, see? These are not shadows. These are warriors that... Uh... Oh, oh. These are warriors that didn't got killed. Didn't get killed. Oh my god, where the fuck I am? And transformed because of the cures. Oh my god. Whoa. Whoa, they behave like a... Like a boss. And he gave me 5k. Not 1500. Like the other guy. That was stronger than this one. Since he had more HP and was tougher to... To stop. Please don't tell me I have to explore. Please. No. 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 I don't want to explore the roofs. Please. Damn it. Fuck. Okay. Let's put some points. Hmm, I don't know, this is a door. A door we need to open, let's put this point here. Okay, um... Hmm. So, we ended from here. And we can go to the right. And explore these parts, that definitely looks like Parts from where you continue. Oh, look at where we are. Can fuck with my ultra instinct. <laughs> it's not like I started playing Souls games yesterday, you know?
What the fuck was the damage? <laughs> he didn't die. <laughs> Kill everything. Okay. So before entering there, it was possible to climb up here. There is no point to climb up here. So that's from where we arrived. Okay, and now I think the level design is top tier. It is amazing because you see these guys using these spells. And you think, whoa, cool. I want to use that spell too. <laughs> so previously they used one, now they used another one. And I think slowly they build up your 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 desire to have these new spells, to, ch to try them, to see if they are strong, uh, to see if they, they work well, if they hit the enemy easier compared to others. I think it's pretty cool. Okay, looking at the map uh, doesn't help, at least doesn't help me in this situation. So from that grace we explored. Until before this part here. Let's get there later, maybe. So let's go back in this direction. We still have five, uh, five flasks. So we saw we can't really jump up there. The only way to proceed is enter here. The attack from Cratched, uh, it's pretty good because it's it's fast. And, and you also have the bonus that uh, if you walk Cratched, it's harder for the enemies to spot you. Store room key, maybe it will be a key to the, the, to the other room, who knows. Throwing dagger. So does this mean this guy had daggers 
but then this path here went down. But that does mean that this guy was trying to run away and, and got killed by with a long range uh, weapon essentially, stopping him from running. Oh my god, these parts up here are bigger than I thought. Way bigger. Maybe there gave a shortcut. It looks like a shortcut to the left part close to the grace at the start of the game. my right oh this is the door at the start of the game at the start of of the place whoa okay pretty cool okay nice nice because we managed to connect uh, this part let's check if there are any secrets uh, no when we see this kind of fog it means we just die Okay. Uh, okay, so we are right from here. From this door. Back here we can just jump back. Or grab the titan. Meanwhile someone died, maybe it was trying to follow me. Ooh, look, this is interesting. This is a <laughs> so you reach this place. Well, depth's key. Oh my god, don't tell me I'm a... How can I be such a genius? I have an instinct of about uh, exploration that is crazy. So you're telling me that was that the 12 there? And I couldn't really complete the exploration of that. But now since I have this key, I can... I can. Okay, so... The part up here... Makes you reach this place, essentially. Okay, they're less dangerous than I thought, hopefully. Oh, 
know, these guys get different kind of items. Golden or the orn tender. So they don't always give you the thing uh, that boosts you. Oh, they're upgrading at the bottom of the well in Belurat. The tower settlement. So this place is still called Belurat. This is the Gaul of Belurat. Oh. Oh, oh, I'm fucked. No. Oh, fuck. Ah. I want to attack him to finish him. I know this. I didn't have enough strength. I know this is that too late. After I already used the attack. Oh no. Okay. Yeah, fuck you. Oh, this guy's the spawn. Okay, but they give you the good items just once. Oh no! Uh. I press the button to dodge, but I, I started running instead. Okay, I'm very confused. Why the fuck is that guy here? Did he manage to chase me? Oh my god, what the heck is happening? Why she doesn't dodge? Hmm. 
<clears throat> I thought I had more uh, room for eating him, but I was wrong. Okay, coming here. From here, it's a bit annoying, so let's ignore the thing and go back to the right place. Nah, I can go there. Forced to go this way. <sighs> oh. Oh my god. I don't remember if he got staggered with the heavy attack, we'll try. Oh fuck. Okay. <clears throat> so went down here. another way to reach this place so this is explored hmm. oh come on so cringe So, left or right, uh, I don't know, let's take a look at the left. 
So this from where we can arrive. There's another part to explore. Okay, it's just a place full of scorpions. Oh, this is different. Or it's just the light. This looks red. <clears throat> I don't know. Maybe give them just different color, they are slightly different. Like one is the male, one the other is the female, since they are different colors. Usually, females in the insects are bigger. <coughs> that could be that this one was the male, the red one. Because look at a little, little uh, smaller. What the? Okay. Oh my god. Okay, what does this mean? There, there is one evolved that is stronger. Or it's just something grotesque. There are a lot of these things, so... Hmm. It means they are mutating. So maybe generation after generation... Uh, there will be one that is way different. I went down here, my arm... My, my arm sinistral, what? The fuck? Uh, a medium for spirit calling in the product, product of the ancient exing arts of... Of the Tao, you see, rank or shot. I don't really understand. Okay, now we are on the other side. Okay, to jump down here, we don't need to do this from here. We can do this from a lot of places. So let's not jump now. There's a tag power when someone's spirit dies. 
Le sue Death Plus sono diventate un po' cringe. Just an offer to... I don't know. Oh, wait. This is a mask. This lion thing is a mask. Let me get that went all the way here. Especially on a place like this that I don't know. Doesn't really have anything uh, particular. It was very well lit then this place. So it should report to Abjur or Jacques. That we found another of these Miguelas uh, bats. Okay, so this side is explored. There is still that part down there. Okay. Yep. There's nothing more here. Just to be sure, let's check once more. Okay, maybe the upper part will be connected somewhere. But not here. Okay, again, so from there we can arrive. We can explore down here. We have the other roofs, the well, and the other door. Seven flasks. Okay, let's see what's in here. Okay, this is probably connected to the to the other part down there. I really don't like that there is nothing here. We're going higher, so we should appear from here on top of uh, the Scorpion building. Hmm. Yep, you're definitely what I thought. It should be the corp uh, almost fallen down exactly. 
Oh, smiting stone one, cool. So we can also grab uh, rank one stones around here. Around uh, this DLC, I mean. Yes, goodbye. See you next time. I'm about to understand if this guy gives you more than 1500 uh, runes and this was just some kind of bug Fifty? Why this thing gives fifteen hundred? <laughs> what is wrong with these guys? This is so fucking cringe. I can't believe this. Why they made this guy give fifteen hundred? He's stronger than the warrior, the knight. Uh, like he has a combo that if you don't spam the dodge, uh, but even if you spam the dodge, if you're not in the right place, you still get hit. Uh, and they gave this guy fifteen hundred uh, runes. Uh. Why the stupid knight? Knight uh, is almost 6k. So cringe. Is this where the boss is? Redman Freya. Okay. So, yes, this is where the boss is. Not yet. Not yet. We have a lot of things to explore first. Hmm. Okay, let's start by jumping uh, down there. I didn't, really, I didn't really manage to understand what's the point of... Oh! This is the point! You have stairs! You have stairs here! Okay, now this makes sense. Okay, this is a very good place from which you can attack uh, these guys. The disgusting one that was vomiting. Oh. -oh. So, why there was the item that gave uh, this thing? Elevates impeding blood loss. Because the guys that were thrown here, they were trying to take whatever 
they could to survive and to feel less pain, even if it was pointless. So, for example, we find a guy that does something that just gives, just alleviates the pain of blood loss. But again, obviously, that's not uh, what they need. In fact, they died. Okay, so we explored this part too. I didn't try to, like, dodge on top of every single wall to see if there is a secret. But I think I can consider myself satisfied like this. Okay. So we we did explore everything, right? Oh no, right. There is just that other part uh, on the right from the second um, grace down here, close to the other warrior. So there's that part there. Ah, they're fighting me. There's this part here. Invaded. Oh, 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 oh. Whoa, what is that weapon? And now, where do I run? Oh, fuck. Nah. Very strange timing because it doesn't shot instantly, but then it runs at you very fast. I pressed the button, but after I got titted. Uh, oh my god. Uh. Here. Yep. Did these attacks by crouching and attacking. It's the same of the dodge one. I know this now.
Oh my god, bro. Whoa. Oh my god. Oh. oh my god, you can fucking do anything. It's very cringe that... Uh, <laughs> His character, the voice actor has a voice, but then the NPC does an, has another voice. <laughs> when you eat him, uh, he does a different kind of voice. Oh my god. Oh my god. Ah, the stupid NPCs are so annoying. They are very hard to predict. Uh, and they do way too much damage and they have way too, my, too many HP. Come on. Oh, what the fuck? Just die. Fucking insect. Tu sei d'insignia. E se da qua guardate il finico enemy. Wow! Grand finito in skill to an armament. That's what shriek of sorrow. Che dovrebbe sbagli di... Down trot, down trot, trot then. Scream causing nearby enemies to flinch. Also recalling deep seated resentment, boosting attack power based on the amount of HP remaining. HP the greater the effect. Whoa. Oh my god, we got a bunch of very cool things here. Okay. And for fish, let's equip this one. It definitely helps against uh, enemies during the exploration, why not? Well, we need to see if I can put uh, the super heavy affinity to this weapon, because, I don't know, maybe I haven't needed an, an item to unlock that, but Maybe I don't have it. I can't, I can't put whatever affinity I want to any weapon. I need to check that. Hmm. 
interesting that this kind of tombs resembles those uh, those trees. Well, so I think I can consider this part explored too. I think I'm not missing anything. Trying to jump inside there doesn't look like a good idea. You can't even do that. Okay. Okay. Okay, let's start by this door. Let's see if this is actually the storage room. And then we need to check around the, the roofs. So from here to this side. Yep. This was the storeroom. Let's see what's in here. An NPC. Because this is a, an old uh, shadow born racist. <laughs> if I'm not wrong, she said that ooh, someone come, probably the guys of the normal head tree, not the shadow head tree, and contaminated this place or something like that. Yes, I'm right, she's an old racist. But she's right, I think. See? This is not a head, this is some kind of... Uh, elm. The fuck did I appear now? Very confused. What is the point of this? So it talked about a sacred beast, maybe it's again that boss we saw on the trailer, maybe. Maybe if we, if we fight uh, that boss. My god, how do I remove this? Ok, 
Okay, well, I removed it some way. Maybe if I fight and defeat that boss and I come back here, she tells something more. Maybe she falls in despair and then says something new, something more interesting. Okay, let's try to look around the, these roofs. Around here, it doesn't look like there is nothing uh, in particular. It doesn't look like we can jump there. So, hopefully, the expression of this roof uh, ended here. Not even an item uh, in this angle, nothing. Okay. Now, let's check this way. Well, I guess it's just a way for them to let you look uh, a bit more carefully to their creation. Okay, at least here there is an item. And again, that's it. Because we can access uh, the other roofs that way. So we complete the exploration. We only have the well left, if I'm not wrong. The door, the part there with the, the NPC. Yes, there is just uh, the well. Let's reach the well. Okay. Very, very cool. The level design of this first map, uh, it's very cool. It looks complicated, but it's not. Uh, kind of linear. It's easy to be able to manage to follow everything and learn the map. And you find two keys around, and the two keys are used both in the close to the same place. That's cool. Oh my god, what the fuck is this place now? Uh, okay, this looks like a place for another boss. I, I think it's not a good idea. <laughs> I think it's not a good idea to try to fight that boss. While well, I have 200,000 uh, runes. So let's try to use them first. Okay, I made a, bit, a small mistake here. And to the report here to talk to the guy that said uh, to tell him if we find more of these uh, Miguel's blessings or whatever they are. Oh, Miguel's crossing, cross parts. Bro. Verdigris armor. Okay. Oh, so now you can decide uh, what you want to say to him. I must have, I suspect those kindly Nicola has visited the lands which hold the tower and appears intent on wholly dispossessing himself of this place. They must be seeking entrance to the tower of shadow. Dispossessing uh, of his flesh. So every time we find one of these crosses, we can talk to the guy and discover something more. To enter the... what he said? The shadow? What? What does this mean? Miguel wanted to, to enter the shadow. Maybe because Miguel is an Empyrean. So he, like, he needs to get rid of uh, 
his body or do some kind of sacrifice to be able to go deeper inside this realm. Is it Michela Maricas? Bro. Okay, no, this is not a boss place. What? Why I got? I got suddenly buffed by why? Then I found uh, another thing, but now I'm, rem I'm not remembering. Another useful thing. Oh, like the Ash of War. And I think I also find uh, a new tier. What is this place now? Hmm. This is bigger than I thought. Um, from software, are you fine or what? Oh, you let me go all the way here, and then there is no, there are no items. This is not good game design because you, you make me think that explore, exploring is pointless. That's from where I arrived.
Uh, misinterpreted the attack. Uh, this shit was who was using immunizing charm to. Medic wins uh, listen to poison and rot. Hmm. Okay. Is my imagination or, or I feel like I'm uh, Recovering faster. <clears throat> and they said there was just an extra boss. We explode and grab the item. Looking like there was almost alpha way to get up there, but I'm not so sure. No, I don't even items, it's pointless, right? Okay, we kind of checked around here. Obviously, I can call torrent. Oh. Oh my god, there are a lot. Okay, I found the best place possible to fight these guys. <laughs> mm, oh my god, there are a lot. Okay. I try not to jump down here, be uh, I mean, dodge down here. Because if you do, you then start taking poison. Uh, you start getting more and more poison. Because you like get imbued with the these disgusting uh, liquids. Okay, so this side is explored. <clears throat> uh. 
A lot of them. I try to use the same strategy. Amazing. It's very cool to learn the strategies and things like that. These strategies, I mean, not those. Poison and this is a weapon. Okay, the thing is lowering for some reason. This is a weapon. Poison and <laughs> a gloss stitched together from the fried skin of the victim of a butcher's blood buff. A free target with with deadly poison, raises attack power when poisoning occurs in the vicinity. Project of uh, an unyielding, black impulse toward revenge, fostering those who have had everything burned or stolen from them. These are the weapons of the utterly downtrodden. 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 Poison spear and strike. Okay. Funny. Okay, I don't think I need this anymore. I don't, I don't even need this one, to be fair. See? Where the fuck they were, fucking pieces of shit. This guy is not alone. Oh my god. <laughs> Come on. What the... Oh, okay. Oh my god, it doesn't give a fuck. Go down. <laughs> Congratulations. Honored Warrior's Word. Congratulations, tough guy. You're a fucking crazy cool warrior. Okay, I think we can say we complete the expression of this place too. No, not yet, there are still enemies. Hello?
Okay. I'm pretty sure I explored everything for real. So this is from where we arrived. The left there was the mini boss. To the right we found a bunch of weapons. And now the only way left is this one. Let's go. Let's see where we will appear. Oh, wait a moment. But at the end of the day, I didn't lock uh, the part on the other side. It was the door there. Oh my god. <laughs> Now we reach this place. But the door we saw. What's the door there? Hmm. It's here. It is place here. Definitely interesting. Okay, so we are level 124. I think what we can do is to grab a few more runes to reach level 125 and then we enter what's probably 100% uh, the boss room which is somewhere around here maybe okay thank you for everyone that took a look at this stream I'm pretty happy that we managed to explore completely this Belurat Gaul and also the bull uh, Belwar town, essentially. Again, as always, I'm no Jake, my cats, Rufina.